It's game day, and Evil is in, and the NFL welcome you to the jungle. Welcome to the jungle, Grim. It gets worse here every day. You learn to live like an animal in the jungle where we play. What the hell are you talking about? That shit just pops into his head and comes out through his mouth hole. Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers and lots of lots of beers. The Diamond Krakens take on the Cincinnati Mangles. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. <laughs> Grim Blitzrow with you along with my partner, former player Brickhead Mulligan. Hi. And his life partner, the mini mutant head that lives on the shoulder of Bricks Jr. Hey, you just threw up on my shoulder. I don't often drink beer, but when I do, I get totally shit-faced. I am the world's most intoxicated man. Say that again. <laughs> and it's first and ten. He might have managed to dig out a yard on that one. Not my yard. Got too much buried in, you know, the usual money, bodies, coffee cans filled with, well, uh, you know, mostly coffee. Tastes better, like Eskimos burying salmon heads, kimchi. Fermented anything really tastes good. This guy's going to get mugged in the locker room by his team after the game. Third down and nine. a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Yes. Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. And it's first and ten. It's two-yard run before he stopped. And that'll be second and eight to go. That's a killer. It was right there, and then he dropped it. Ah, oh, scumbag is killing me in the fantasy league. Third down and eight. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It's good. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a bra in my bed. It was a chimp wearing a wig. One time, when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. Line the way a Republican congressman hits the airport men's room. Good and hard. First down. And it's first and ten. Oh, that hit's going to shave a few days off his life. First and ten. Nice run for five yards. Two. 
Second down and five. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. No, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a peck ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Third down and five. Look out, that's an all-out attack on the QB. And the whistle blows the play dead, along with the quarterback. Third down and a pussy here. And he snags it for six. Touchdown! Touchdown! It should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. First and ten. Nice pass. That catch is good for six yards. And that'll be second down and four. First down. And the running game opens up for them and allows the passing game to be more of a threat. Got to keep him guessing. And it's first and ten. The quarterback has had enough and caused a murder ball dirty trick to lay waste to the defense. And at the finger, just... Oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. First and eight to go. Second down and ten. And he's running like a... And the defense gets up five yards there. Third down and five. Oh, great catch! And that's a touchdown! Touchdown! Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. Straight through the uprights. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! First and ten. And the ball razors through the defense, cutting a defender in half. That means you can wrap up the other half and save it for later. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing.
And it's first and ten. And picks up maybe a deuce at most. Uh, speaking of deuces, I got a... Uh... <clears throat> Hey, you got a dollar for the bathroom attendant? He threatened me if I didn't tip him next time. Talk about Butterfingers, he should have had that one. Third down and eight. And Lil Cats will give them a first down. First down and five. And he runs it in for the touchdown. See that move, baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see that because I'm too fast. <laughs> Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double-stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. They need a good return here to set up the offense. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. The teams are all tied up at the end of quarter one. We'll be right back. And it's first and ten. He's got his beast boost working. The player just transformed into a violent form of pure badass. And he's off to the races. He's at the 30. Oh, this guy just loves punishing the defenders. That's a first down. And it's first and ten. And he just wrestles away. I've seen this guy run through a brick wall. He loves pain. First down. And it's first and ten. Interception, and that's how you stop an offense. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. It sounds like my offseason. First and ten. And they stack the line and he gets his bell rung for a yard. Second down and nine. If you don't think you can make the interception, batting it down is the next best thing. Great advice, Grim. That receiver's gonna go far in this league if he listens to you. I wasn't talking to... Yeah, never mind. Yes, Brick, he will. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. First and ten. Hey, man, I just can't want to chill out. I don't want to hell with all fellow. Second down in a lot. 
Looks like the deal. Like every one of my barbecues. This damn man hit charge the ball loose and it's a fumble. Holy crap! He missed ten the spikes and ends up dead. Life is full of misery, Grim. Loneliness, suffering, and then it's over much too soon. And here comes the extra point attempt. It's good. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. That's a nice. Let me tell you, getting shocked is no joke. I used to wear triple wool socks, slide around on a shed carpet for eight hours so I could shock my younger brother. I went to change the TV channel. He got blown across the room into the deer antlers. Second down and five. Third down, and the punter is warming up. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawn. And they'll line up for the punt here. Looks like a pass, and it's bouncing right back to the QB. Oh, it's the sticky ball dirty trick. Ah, oh, pass the popcorn, Grim. Zoom in on his face, then his crotch. I want to see if he cries or pisses himself first. If he can't get the sack, that's the next best thing. Second down and ten. Pick up the first down with a nice piece of running there. And it's first and ten. And he catches it for a touchdown! What a beautiful play! Yeah, it's all those power and ring. What's your high cool? Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just guineas. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. First and ten. Oh, and that one's gonna hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. <laughs> and they take their first time out. Well, how predictable. Surprise us next time. Call the time out during halftime. And it's first and ten. Oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're going to hit a guy that hard, you should at least kill... QB's 
save some clock by calling a timeout. They have one left. And it's first and ten. jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. First down and forever. And he picks up about six on the play. The quarterback burns his last time out. They can't stop the clock anymore. The offense goes into their two-minute drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing as a hurry-up offense, you moron. And that is a big gain. You know the defense wants some payback after that. Third down and five. And that's an incomplete pass. Looks like the defense got away with that one there. Uh, they allowed to grab the receiver like that. He could get hurt. The kicker should make this, but you know how it goes in this league. It's good. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. And it's first and ten. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? Under two minutes of timeout means the QB is playing beat the clock, and he better win. And it's first and ten. Oh, with the punishing hit. The timeout is called by the quarterback. They have one left. The offense wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry up. Yeah, same as Britz's ex-girlfriend signaled when they were doing it. Yeah, she called it rabbit sex. I took it as a compliment. Oh, well, sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. And that's the end of the second quarter. Someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the halftime show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Franken food you'll have fun trying to identify. The teams line up for the kickoff to start the second half. These guys will have to play a lot harder to make it a game. Yeah, well, no, either that or kill and yeah. cheat more. <laughs> the teams are lined up for the kickoff. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he named his clothing company. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. And it's first and ten. Oh, nice hit. Second down in a very lot. He broke free and has open field in front. 
one of them. And it's first and ten. And the defense, there's no reason to drop the ball if you're still alive. He's at the 40. The 30. The 20. He's at the 10. And they're catching up. Jump, jump, jump it. At some point, they're going to need to put this rep out of his misery. Uh, how about now, for instance, if you hit 30 tricks and pass the rep? down an inch it. Defense says enough of this BS and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. And it's first and ten. Picks up two yards on the pass. Then this guy's six feet tall. He could just have fallen over and gotten two yards. And that'll be second and eight. And the defense goes for the juggler. And if he was still talking, he'd probably be saying, Psycho killer, Keska say, what the fuck, the fuck, the fuck? The offense has only one quarterback left. If he dies, it's game over. Yeah, there's no QB. He don't even look too confident. He's bleeding with the coach on the sidelines about something. Yeah, he's telling his coach to punt. What a pussy. And that'll be second down and four. He turned into a mutant fireball with that flame on dirty trick. And anything he touches gets flumbed. Touchdown! Oh, he ran through those defenders like a greased turkey. And they line up for the extra point. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck off. That was just a one time thing. And it's first and ten. Ouch! What is this, 80s wrestling? Second and three. game is starting to soften up the defense first down and it's first and ten and that's a sack speaking of sacks has anybody seen my powder i'm itching like crazy over here <laughs> Second down and a lot. That's a four-yard gain. Third down and, well, good luck. And he snatches that one out of the air for a first down. See if they can get something going here. 
And it's first and ten. He zigged when he should have zagged and ends up a shish kebab. And the quarterback dribbles one in for the first down. First and ten. He dropped it. If he does that again, they'll drop him. Second down and ten. which will slice its way through any defensive player trying to... And he put on the afterburners after that catch and score. Nicely done! Kicking us for pussies, Bricks. They're going for two. Yeah, they got big balls, Glenn. Yeah, bigger than yours. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. One time when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. Man, he shoveled his feet so well on that play. He should go to lost wages and deal cards. First down! And it's first and ten. Remember, folks, in the NFL, you are allowed to touch the quarterback just like that. Hey, yo, gang, man, kill. Come on, I got him. Get on, I got him. Get him out. Get him. Second down, and ain't gonna happen, partner. was equal parts great run and bad defense. Third down and long. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. Now well, here comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I have pictures that... Uh, well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on here. He's got the ball now. Let's see what he does with it. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. Second down and long. Third down and the punter is warming up.
brings us to the end of the third quarter. They'll need to fire on all cylinders to make a comeback in the final quarter. And it's first and ten. And then a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. And it's first and ten. Oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. First down and one. And the defense gets the quarterback for a sack. Second down and six. And that was a perfect pass, and he scores handily. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> Straight through the uprights. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. First and ten. Oh, devastating hit. You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep. Third grade. Sister Mary Margaret of Our Ladies of Holy Hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. First down. He hit that line the way it rolled up down the bill, sticking out of flimsy Lohan's nose. It's a mare in Lost Wages, Nevada. And it's first and ten. <laughs> Nicely done for a first down. And it's first and ten. Oh, now the offense is getting kills. Uh, this is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. The Cincinnati Bengals pulverized the opposition today and win by forfeit. The entire game was trench warfare. Both teams battling back and forth, bruised and battered, but in the end, there could be only one winner. There are winners in my book. I think that a feeder team should get a participation award because well, they try really hard. Why don't you try real hard to shut the fuck up? Nice mouth. Why don't you try to lay off the Scots, Junior? Suck on it. Real nice. Let's go to the game's MVP. <laughs> Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not happy.